Here's the right way versus the wrong way to memorize the notes of the fretboard. E, F, F sharp, G, G sharp, A, A sharp, B, C, C sharp, D, D sharp, E. First the right way. F, E flat, G sharp, E. This guy is actually a student of mine. The problem with the first method is you aren't memorizing the notes on the fretboard, you're memorizing the order. This will not work when you try to improvise a solo because you don't have time to be counting up to the right note. By the time you do find that note, it's gonna be two bars back and you're gonna be too late. With the second method, you're finding the notes completely at random. This means that you genuinely memorize the notes on the fretboard and you're not dependent on an order like you were with the first method. So to do this, step one, go to this website. Step two, set a stopwatch. Step three, find all the notes on one string. Step four, pause the stopwatch and write down how long it took you to find all the notes. Step five is move on to the next string and repeat. 52-week guitar player enrollment resumes in mid-June. Sign up to the waiting list now. Now just leave.